You are going to like this, so I save with me until then. Welcome to Math with Teacher MJ. In this video, I'm going to cover a basic SAT math problem that many get it wrong, but what is the question and why many get it wrong. So first, I'm going to show you the biggest mistake that people make when they are going to solve this type of question. Then we will talk about the right way and how to find the correct answer in seconds. But what is the question? Let me write the question. The question says, find the value of 7 divided by 7 divided by 7 divided by 7 while option A 1 option B 1 over 14 option C 21 option D 1 over 49 but what? the question looks easy Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. But why I say many get it wrong. So now I'm going to show you the biggest mistake that people do when they are going to solve this type of question. But what is their mistake? Let's solve the question like how they solve this type of question. To solve this, usually they start with this division. So they say seven divided by seven is one, and this seven divided by seven is one, and one divided by one is one and they are happy that they can solve this type of question in seconds and they will choose option a but let me ask you a question is this true no 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 but why what is the reason what's wrong seven divided by seven one right seven divided by seven one one divided by one one why i say it is not true remember to solve this type of question, we need to follow a set of rules that is called the order of operation. The order of operation says when we have more than one division in one expression, we need to start from left one, right one, or middle one, which one of them. The order of operation says when we have more than one division, we need to start from once on the left and continue our work to the right. So let me rewrite the question. 7 divided by 7 divided by 7 divided by 7 so as the order of operations says we need to start from once on the left so 7 divided by 7 is 1 it is going to be 1 divided by 7 divided by 7 again we have more than one division we need to start from once on the left 1 divided by 7 is 1 over 7. So it is going to be 1 over 7 divided by 7. Now we have only one division. We can convert division to multiplication. It is going to be 1 over 7 times 1 over 7. To solve this 1 times 1, 1. 7 times 7, 49. And 1 over 49 is the correct answer. Option 1, option A, absolutely no. Option B, no. Option C, no. And the correct answer, option D. Do not forget, I'm waiting for your positive energy in the comments below. Have fun.